Okay, I thought I had garbage bags, but I don't. So I'm dumping them in the back of the truck for now. Anyway, I made four dollars just in that one garbage can. I see they're picking them up. It might be that I'm a little late. They are clearing the place out after all. look under the bleachers. Underneath bleachers is always a good place to find alcohol containers. Yeah. Look you didn't see. Nothing here. Yeah, still four dollars from that first can is pretty good. Where they put all the display, the chickens and the goats and things. You know, I might have gotten here just a little late, and if I did, all of it. But still, let's walk up from here. Generally. Camp when they're working here, and so you often will find bottles, things, cans in through here. If they haven't already been around to clean up, behind the water johns. Yeah, pretty nasty. You don't want to see what I just saw. Pretty nasty. Yeah, you can see where they were parked here. Yeah. All right. So far, no fortunes are being made, but still, I did make four dollars from that one garbage can. So that's four dollars more than I had. I won't complain. Anyway, let's just keep walking along here. When I was a kid, it was always an exciting time of the year. 
when the fair would come to town. And here is where the midway would have been set up. Um, this way. I saw some garbage bags there beside the um, Reiner's cans. And they, they collect pop cans for their hospitals and whatnot. So chances are those bags are, have their cans and I don't, I don't interfere with that. So, uh, that's why I'm not going over that way. I see their the cans they use for collection and I don't I don't ever mess with those. But there are a bunch of leechers here. So maybe possibly we'll find some cans. Or some bottles. Maybe. in this area that they have the tractor poles and the demolition derby and all that stuff. <laughs> yeah. Well, Not a lot so far, but that's all right. Like I say, I think I got here a little too, uh, late as all. garbage can over there. Let's see. Oftentimes in along here you'll find beer bottles and beer cans too. We'll have a look over there in a minute. Pepsi can. Nothing there. You can tell this is where the horses were. This is the horse venue. Well, oh, it's a good day to be a seagull when the fair is on. Hey, <laughs> this must be a great time for them. like a king standing there, master of all he surveys. Let's keep going. Okay. I'm going to start in this corner over here. Well, actually, what I'll do is I'll walk up around, and then I'll come back this way. That's what I'll do.
tractors. Rogers Road, well, uh, Arthur Street is that way, Cockburn Street is that way, oh wait a minute, no, that, that's South Street, that's Rogers Road, that's Cockburn Street, and that's Arthur Street, right, and I'm walking towards Arthur Street, oh, wait a minute, I'm seeing something now. Yeah, here we go. I knew it. <laughs> yeah. You can see these ones are brewed in Canada. It says brewed by Labatt. So even though it's an American beer, it's brewed under license in Canada, and therefore it's a 10 cent can. Oh, there's a whiskey bottle too. Awesome. This is worth 20 cents. It's a big whiskey bottle. It's a vodka bottle. So it's worth 20 cents. Okay, so 20, 30, 40, 50. I made 50 cents so far. Just on this little stretch. Alright. So I'm up to $4.50 profit so far. Let me look at this one and see what it is. Looks like it's just a regular can, but I'm not going to throw it back now that I picked it up because that would be littering. 